This model mimics the flow of water over the damaged spillway of the tallest dam in the United States. The Oroville Dam stands at 770 feet. A concrete spillway carries away excess water when levels in the reservoir get too high. It's important to release this water safely because a flood from that height can be especially devastating. This February, after a particularly wet California winter, the spillway cracked and failed. When excess water needed to be released, it splashed down the hillside. More than 100,000 people were temporarily displaced. The California Department of Water Resources tasked a team from the Utah Water Research Lab to build a scale model of the damaged spillway so they could know what they were dealing with. The model is over 100 feet long, but is still only 1 50th the size of the real dam. Water glides over acrylic plastic that simulates the smooth concrete of the spillway, then splashes onto concrete rocks. The team built the spillway from the original construction designs and got the shape of the surrounding terrain from a Department of Water Resources LIDAR survey. They then cut and welded steel plates to support the basic shape of the concrete. Since California's next rainy season begins in November, the team had to work fast. They completed the model in just 40 days. They used the model to measure water force on different parts of the structure and to test how much water the broken system could handle in an emergency. The Oroville Dam spillway is scheduled to be repaired by the fall, and the team is now converting the model to test the repairs. For Scientific American, I'm Andrew Golden.